Hi, I'm Karen Wise. I am here to do 45 minutes of shred with you. So shred is going to be five blocks of exercises that we've got four to five exercises per block. Lots of fun. You're going to get the whole body. The first block really focuses on the legs. And then we intermittently put, of course, throughout it, some core, some abs. You're going to get everything, upper body, of course, heart rate up. You're going to love it, <laughs> but I do want you to take this at your pace. So that means please shut your phone off unless you want to put on your favorite playlist uh, to keep you motivated. But let's try to focus on what you're doing. Focus on each exercise so that you can do it with the best form, get the most benefit and not hurt yourself. And know when you need to modify because it's okay. You'll see there's some uh, exercises that I grab smaller weights for or that I'll put my knees on the mat. We all need to modify certain exercises, so please feel free to do that, okay? So I'm also, besides weights in a mat, I'm gonna be using this chair to lift up, okay? To stand up and stand down, you'll be holding a weight. So something you can do that on. I'm gonna be using the couch for tricep dips. All right, so feel free to grab a bench or a chair or something like that. If you don't have the bench to do the step up, so you can lunge and you can lift up, if you don't have um, a couch or something to do tricep dips, or if that bothers your shoulders, you can do tricep kickbacks, okay? But either way, let's work together. Let's keep ourselves healthy. Let's do the very best, and most importantly, make yourself proud. Here we go. All right, you guys, welcome to Shred 45. So glad that you're here. Make sure you've got a, a mat. Make sure you've got some type of, um, this chair works for me. I'm going to be stepping up. I'm gonna be doing tricep dips, things like that. So if you've got a bench or a chair, um, that would be a good idea. You, I'll, I'll show you ways to do it without that. And then a couple different pairs of weights, okay? So let's go ahead and take those legs apart and start to touch those toes. All right, so you're bringing that leg across the body, keeping those abs engaged, and lifting those toes up, lengthening hamstrings, Getting those hip joints ready to work today. Good. So once again, good for you for making time for this. It is never easy, but you'll be glad that you did. Let's start with those legs in the middle now. And let's just go ahead and kind of lunge side to side. All right, let's open up our chest at the same time. So my thumbs are up and I'm just bending that outside knee as I lunge to the side, all right? And again, opening up those chest muscles. So if you've been sitting at a computer or looking at a phone throughout your morning, this is good to open up that chest. One more time. All right, let's inchworm out. Start with the back of your mat, start at the back of your mat. Go ahead and lunge that right leg. Let's hold the twist. And walk yourself back. Roll our shoulders back. Let's do the left leg this time. So a nice big lunge. Make sure on that lunge that this knee is right above the ankle. And let's do it one more time on each side. All right, so inchworm it out. Right lunge and hold. And you may want notice that your range of motion or your hips or shoulders are probably a little different on each side. My light left shoulder joint tends to be a little bit tighter. So I try to just try my best to open it up, even it out. So we're touching those toes again. So today our number is going to be 10. We'll do 10 of each exercise today. And we've got five blocks of exercises. Oh, nice, fun stuff to do. <laughs> All right, let's start in the middle and let's open the chest. So I'm gonna try to keep my, in, excuse me, my inside leg straight and I'm bending that outside knee. Good, we're just gonna do four more. And three, good, two, and one. All right, take a second to roll those shoulders back. And our first exercise, 
We're gonna need one medium weight for, we are gonna press it over the head. So we're gonna start in about 10 seconds. I want those feet to be hip width apart. I'm holding it in my right arm first. So here we go. We're gonna go for 10. I'm gonna hand it off above my head, okay? Nine. If that's too hard, you can hand it off here. Eight, all right? Seven. Six. And five. Four more, make sure you're sitting back into your heels. Three, two, and one. Good job. So you're gonna put that down. We're gonna take our right leg in front, okay? So I'm gonna lunge, tap my left toe. That's one. Right leg stays stationary. Two, three. Opposite hand is reaching across. Four, and five, six, this first block is gonna be leg heavy. Seven, eight, nine, and 10. Good job. All right, third exercise. Think deadlift. Romanian deadlift just simply means we're gonna have those feet wider. Knees are just slightly bent. Abs are engaged. All right, so knees just slightly bent. There's one. Your back is straight. Two, good, so you can see from the side. Three, back is like a tabletop. Four, squeeze the glutes as you come up. That's five. And six, stay zipped up through the middle. Seven, you got three more. And eight. nine, and 10. Good job. Left leg is gonna be stationary now. Lunge, we're gonna kick the right foot. One, make sure it's a nice deep lunge before you keep going. Two, three, opposite hand reaching across. Four, how far back can you take that right leg? Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. That one medium weight. Here we go, narrow squat, abs engaged. Let's switch above the head. One, careful. Two, three, four, good job. Five, sit back into your heels. Six, good. Seven, woo. Eight. Nine. And 10. All right, weight down. Right leg is stationary. Lunge, tap your left toe. One, two, three. Holding that lunge for a second. Four, right knees right above the ankle. Five, six, seven, woo, eight, nine, and 10. Romanian deadlift, so two weights, feet are wide, abs are engaged. Knees are just soft. So don't think about bending those knees. Think about just soft knees, You're not, they're not locked. Three, engage that center as you come down. Four, your back is like a tabletop. Five, six, squeeze those glutes as you lift. Woo! Seven, eight, just two more. Nine, and 10. Let's put those weights down. Left leg is stationary, swinging that right leg. 10, nine, opposite hand reaches across. Eight, seven, 
Woo, balance. Six, five, four, three. Working hard, two strong legs, and one. Grab that one medium weight. We've got about two and a half minutes left in this block. Here we go, narrow squat. One, careful handing it off. Two, three, four, five, woo, six, seven, eight, two more, nine, and ten. The weight goes down, right leg is stationary. Lunge, tap that toe, one, tapping those left toes, two, three, four, five, woo, six, good, seven, eight, nine, and ten, Romanian deadlift, wide feet, Abs are engaged, knees are soft. Squeeze those glutes. One, two, three. From that side, the back is a tabletop best you can. Four, not looking for perfection, just safety while we're working these muscles. Four more, especially hamstrings and glutes here. Three more. Two more. One more. Should be getting out of breath. Good, left leg is stationary. Knees right above the ankle. Let's tap the right toe. 10, nine, eight, seven, don't forget your smile. Six, woo, five, four, three, two, and one. Get that one smaller weight. We just have a few reps of that squat overhead switch. Narrow squat. Good, one more on each. Last one. Good, take 30 seconds off. Breathe. All right, we're gonna do some skaters to start off the next block, but we're gonna hop twice on each side. We'll start in about 15 seconds. So it's gonna be a double hop. We're gonna start in five and we're gonna do 10 on each side. Three, two, and one. So it's one, two, three, four, little hop, five, six, seven, eight, nine, count to 10 again because we want 10 on each side. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, whew, four, three, two, and one. We're gonna have one medium weight. Go ahead and have a seat. Wide leg roll up and we're gonna lift a leg if you want. This is gonna be 10 total. Abs are engaged. One, you don't have to lift the leg. Two, you could come up and reach for the toe. Good, three, whoo. Four, zip up through that center. Five, it's not from the neck, it's from your abs. Six, controlled movements. Seven, whoo. Eight, you've got two more. Nine, and 10. Now, weight down, we've got the bicycle. 10 on each side. Lift from the rib cage, please. Here we go. One, two, three. Lift the rib cage up. Four, five, six, whew, seven, 
eight, nine, 10. Good. We've got plank rows next. So go ahead and grab two weights. If you do plank rows, please put your knees on the mat as a modification if you need to, okay? So we're gonna do 10 total, wrists or below the shoulders. Here we go. One, two, that elbow comes all the way up. Three, four, from your knees if you need to. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. All right, you guys, one more exercise for this block. Superman burpee, all right? So I want you to jump back for your burpee, come all the way to the mat, lift in your Superman. Come on up, one. Good, abs are lifted up as you come down. Superman, woo! Two, yes. Reach into Superman. Three, if you'd rather step back, you can. Lower down. Superman. You can step forward instead of jump. Four, we got six more. Woo! Reach. Try to not shrug those shoulders as you're doing Superman. So think about long arms, but not shrugging those shoulders. Woo! Last three. Let's do this. Be strong. You're your best. Last two. Nothing like burpees to get our heart rate up. Woo! One more, one more. Reach. Good job. All right. Starting with the double hop skaters. Take a break if you need to. One, two, three, woo, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Grab that smaller weight. You've got your wide leg roll up. Lift the leg up to meet the weight if you want to. Engage that center. Here we go. Woo! One. Two. You're over a third of the way into your workout. Three. Really focus. Doing your best. Four, woo, five, six, woo -hoo. seven, eight, you've got two more, so not from the neck, from that center. Good, one more, one more. Good, come on down, bicycle, 10 each side. Zip up, lift the rib cage. Here we go. One, two, three options. Four, five, so that foot could be on the ground. Six, you decide. Seven, strong. Eight, whoo. Nine, and ten. Who remembers the wonderful Superman burpees? That's what we get to do next. Aren't we lucky? Here we go. Wrist below the shoulders. Good. Woo. One. Come on down. Two. We missed those plank rows. That's okay. We're going to do them in just a second. I knew I missed something. <laughs> Three. I always say, thank God I'm not perfect. <laughs> we are not looking for perfection here. We're doing our best. Woo! Four, you got six more. Reach. Five. Woo-hoo! 
Yes. Six, you should be feeling this by now. Keep breathing, doing our best. We got three more. Woohoo! Two more. Oh, yeah. One more. One more. Woo! All right. Plank rows. Grab those weights. Yes, you can. Got faith in you guys. Here we go. 10, elbow all the way up. Nine from the knees if you need to. Eight, seven, six, woo! Five, zip up through the middle. Four, three, two, and one. Awesome. Woo, 30 second break. High five on that one. Not an easy block. All right, so our next exercise, we're gonna be holding a medium weight and we're gonna be stepping up on our bench, right leg. If you don't have a bench, your right leg is in front. You're gonna lunge and hold, okay? So take a breath, grab some water, get ready. And right leg on top, here we go. One, think about pushing through the heel of that leg that's on top. Three, four, woo, five, six, seven. Right leg stays up there. Eight, woo, nine, and 10. All right, we got tricep dips next. Tricep dips. Here we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. Good, strong. 3, 2, 1. All right, step up with your left leg. Here we go. Hold that weight near your chest. Zip up to the middle. So let's lift up, pushing with that left heel. Two. Good, three. Woo! Four, strong legs. Five. Six, yes you can. Seven. Eight. Two more. Nine. And 10, skull crushers. So yes, still working those triceps. You can use one or two weights. Lift the hips up into the bridge if that feels all right. Zip up through your middle. The weights come towards your forehead, not behind you. Okay, I don't want you to hurt your shoulder joint. All right, weights come towards the forehead. Five, zip up through your middle. Six, good, seven, woo, eight, nine, and 10. Stand up for bicep curls, all right? So bicep curls, I'm gonna start out by standing on my right leg. You can come to your left toes or lift it up. So I'm starting with my palms facing me and I'm rotating on the way up, good. Two, you could find a spot to stare up for balance. That helps. Three. Four. Five. I'm going to switch legs. Six. The balance part's up to you. Seven. Woo! Good. Eight. Two more. Nine and 10. Let's put one weight down. Start out with that right step up again. Right leg on top. You're going to push through that right heel to lift. There's one, two, three, four, 
three, strong right leg, four, woo, five, six, I hope you're sweating too, seven, woohoo, eight, you got two more, nine, and ten, tricep dips, here we go. Strong triceps. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Woo! All right. One weight. Left leg on top. Smile on your face. Here we go. 10, 9, woohoo! 8, 7, yes you can, 6, keep breathing, 5, stand up tall, 4, 3, oh yeah, 2, and 1, you're awesome, skull crushers, here we go one or two weights. Hips are lifted into that bridge. Zip up through your middle. The weights come towards your forehead, not behind you. One, two, three, four, good, five, six, four more, seven, woo, eight, nine, ten. Let's do some bicep curls. Come on up. I'll stand on my left leg first this time. You decide whether you're doing the balance. So I'm starting with the palms facing me, rotating up. Two, good. Three, yes you can. Four, woo! Five, I'm gonna switch legs. Six, you got it. Seven, eight, woo, two more. Nine, and 10. All right, guys, for time's sake, I'm gonna do five on one leg, five on the other, starting with the right. Here we go. Five, four, push with the right heel, three, two, one. I'm going to switch legs. Five, four, woo, three, two, and one tricep dips. Let's go for it. Here we go. Keep your body close to whatever you're using for tricep dips. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Right in two skull crushers. Both for triceps, not easy. Let's do what we can. If you need to go down to one weight for these triceps, skull crushers, you can do it. Here we go. Remember the weights come towards your forehead. Two, zip up through that middle. Three, whoo, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Ten. Come on up for bicep curls. Almost ready for that 30 second break. Here we go. One. Woo. Two. Three. Four. Five. I'm switching legs. Six. Seven, woohoo! Eight, two more, then you get a break. Nine, 
nine and 10. Good job, you guys. All right, 30 second break. Make sure part of that break is getting water. All right. So we are going to be doing a right row and a right back lunge. All right. So you're going to do a right row and a right back lunge. So we're going to start in 10 seconds. Those feet are gonna be together, so you're gonna do a row, and then you're gonna lunge back, okay? So zip up through that middle, let's bend over, here we go. So row and lunge. Row and lunge, that's two. Three. Four, deep lunge if you can. Five, woo! Six. Seven. Three more. Eight, woo! Nine. and 10. Good. Hope you guys are working hard too. All right. Donkey kick, jumping jack. I'm going to use my couch for this. You can take your hands to the mat if you'd prefer. Here we go. Donkey kick, one. Options for low impact, two, three, four, five, Woo! Six, seven, eight, two more, nine, ten. Woo! All right, you guys. Yes, left row, left lunge. Here we go. Row. Lunge, that's one. Balance and strength can both be better on one side. That's why we like to do sides separately sometimes. Give that non-dominant side a chance to work. Good, that's four. Woo! That's five. Yes, you can. Your very best. Seven. Woohoo! Eight. Two more. Nine. And ten. We've got the Arnold press next. If you've had any shoulder issues, I would grab smaller weights. Okay? The knees bent, abs are strong, arms are here, okay? Press, so let's rotate. Press them up and together. Press them up, so we're kind of reversing it a little bit, and together. Press them up and together. Palms facing you, press them up and together, good. Five. Six, seven, woo, eight, two more, nine, and ten. All right, we've got that right row and that right reverse lunge. Doing our best. Here we go. Right row, one. Stand up for that lunge. We've got two. Woo! Three. Four. Oh, yeah. Five. Six. Four more on this side. Woohoo! Seven. Eight, last two, 
One more. And good. All right. Donkey kick. Jump your back. Smile on your face. Here we go. One. Two. Low impact version. Three. Four. Five. Six. Woohoo. Seven. Having fun yet? <laughs> Nine, ten, left row, left reverse lunge. Finish strong, everybody. One more block after this. One, woo, two, three. Good, four. Oh yes, we can. Five. Six. We're taking a break after this one. Seven, we got three more. Eight. Good, two more. Woo! One more. Awesome, guys. All right, take your break. Breathe. One more block. Four exercises. We are going to start with an inchworm shoulder tap, inchworm back. We're going to do that 10 times. Woo! Let's start in about six seconds. Come to the back of your mat. You got this. Let's do this. Here we go. So inchworm it out, wrist below the shoulders. If you need to take your knees down as you do the shoulder tap, you can. Please roll your shoulders back in between. Knees down if you need to. Good, that's two. Woo! Good, hips at neutral if possible. Not lifting too high. Good, let's make that core work zip up through that middle. Five more to go. Woo! Yes. Four more to go. Three more. I hope you're out of breath too. <laughs> Woo! We got it. Two more times. One more. We're getting tired, but we're not giving up. Good job. All right, you guys. Right hip dip. You are going to come into that right side plank on your forearm. Right knee on the mat if you want. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Good. 5. So good for the obliques. Two and one. Now, super crunch. I'll show you modification. All right. So you can come all the way down, all the way up. That's one. Modification, bring the knees in. Two. All right. Or one knee in. Three. Four. Strong. Five. Controlled, not flinging those arms. Six. Woo! Seven, as controlled as you can. Eight, nine, with your smile. And 10, left hip dips. Left knee on the mat if you want to. Here we go. Up for the challenge. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, woo! Three, two, one. Good job. All right, let's inchworm. I promise a great stretch. 
in about two minutes. Here we go. So inchworm it out, zip up through that middle. There's one. Roll those shoulders back. You don't have to rush. Woo! Knees can be down. That's two. Yes, hips at neutral. We're not lifting those hips. Ah, three. Minute and a half to our stretch. Woo! Four. Here comes number five. Good. Here's number six. Feel free to take those knees down if you need to. Last three. Woo! Feeling it. Last two. One minute till our stretch. One more. Woohoo! All right. Right hip dips. Let's do five on one side, five on the other. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch to the other side. You got it. Five, four, three, two, one. Super crunch or one knee in or whatever you can do. Here we go. Zip up through the middle. That's one. Not from the neck, it's from that center. Two. Don't forget your options. Three. Four. Five. Do what's right for you. Six. Last four, then we stretch. Woo! Seven. Eight. Last two. Nine and 10. Woo! Nice job, everybody. I want you to sit up at first. Take your right leg straight out. Left leg crosses over it. Right arm hugs it in. Shoulders down. I hope you're proud of yourself. Most importantly, you are here to impress yourself. Let's switch. Because when you're proud of yourself for following through with a commitment that you made to yourself, how powerful is that at making sure that you'll keep commitments after this as well? So new, do a nice cat-cow stretch first. Woo! Glance up. Good. I'm going to stretch my right calf. Press my whole body weight back. Good. And switch. Left calf. Good, my right leg is gonna lunge. Hands on the inside of the foot. I'm gonna take my left quadriceps, sink forward. Notice my right ankle and knee stay in alignment. Relax those hips. Right arm up and twist. Good, the foot comes to the middle. I'm gonna take my left knee up. I'm gonna tuck my pelvis under, lean back. I'm gonna carefully bring that knee back down Shift my body weight back, lower my chest for that right hamstring stretch. Whew. Good, right knee down, nice cat-cow stretch. Good job, let's lunge that left leg. Hands on the inside of the foot as we pull the hips forward, that knee should stay right above the ankle. Sink your right quadricep down. Left arm up, gentle twist. Good. Let's bring that left foot to the middle of the mat. Tuck your right toes under, right knee up. Let's tuck the pelvis under. Balance. <laughs> Lean back. All right. Right knee down. We're going to shift back. Lower the chest to stretch that left hamstring. Deep breath. Good. Let's come on up to standing. Relax the shoulders. Take your right arm across. Look to your left, and then just look to the right. Open it up. Left arm across. Shoulders are not shrugging. And just look in the opposite direction. Good. Right hand between shoulder blades. Gently press. 
Take your right fingertips, inch them to the left shoulder. And same thing on the left. Stretch the left tricep, inch those fingertips to the right shoulder. And relax the arms, right fingertips point down, gently pull them back and switch. Good, nice deep breath in. Exhale, give yourself a hug, walk your fingertips towards one another. Let's do it one more time and take the opposite arm on top. Walk those fingertips. Good. And open it up, deep breath. Exhale, give yourself that pat on the back. High five, nice job.